Good evening, my friends. Tonight, I want to share on the third goal of Operation STL. And that goal is for people to be converted to Christianity. It's for people who are lost to be found, for people who are blind to see, for people who are deaf to hear, for those who are lost to be found, and, and for people to become believers in Jesus. So evangelizing the lost is our third priority, uh, which is all equally a uh, priority, but but uh, reaching out to lost people and preaching the gospel to them and telling them about Jesus is something that we can uh, collaborate together and unify together and, and empower local churches together with. So evangelizing the lost is really a tool to bring churches together and for us to come alongside other churches saying, hey, you know what, look, we might not agree on this, but we do agree that everyone needs to believe in Jesus in order to have hope. And when we when we go out with the goal in mind of reaching lost people, we do this um, knowing that, hey, we, like I said before, we're going to go out, we're going after lost people. We want to make sure that we keep it simple. We want to, this isn't going to look like a church event. This is going to look like uh, an event that's geared towards drawing unbelievers. And we're, when we're trying to reach lost people, we want to focus on, okay, how can we draw them in? Jesus says, I have made you fishers of men. And when you go fishing, you got to have bait. And the bait covers a hook, right? But you don't see the hook. The hook is the gospel, right? But the, but the bait covers the hook. You can't, it's not plain. You know, it's not apparent, but if you, you know, once you're there, it's, it's clear. And we do share the gospel. We share the gospel the whole time for four hours straight because every single who, person who speaks or does music or whatever is all, uh, is all based on an encounter with Jesus Christ that changed the direction of their life and they're sharing that story and sharing about who Jesus is and what he's done for us. And and we believe that when we get out there in a public place and we go, like Jesus said, go uh, in Matthew 28, 19, go and make disciples. When we go and and we unite and we bring the gospel in its simplicity, uh, the cross and Jesus crucified, that people will be reached and converted. And Paul says this, he says, because I'm not ashamed of the gospel of Christ, for it is the power of God unto salvation to everyone that believes. So the power of God is in the gospel. If people hear the gospel, it leads to salvation. So we just got to be in, an, in a place where we can share the gospel. But we don't want to go share the gospel with people who already believe in the gospel. We want to get lost people to hear the gospel. We want to somehow uh, get in a position to uh, be surrounded by lost people and then be sharing the gospel. And that's what we're doing. That's what we're attempting to do. And we're partnering with uh, T4T and, and um, For His Glory Ministry to reach um, them and not just not just preach the gospel to them, but to implement structure and system where they can actually be discipled afterwards. And, and we're trying to introduce them to the churches through um, the partnerships that we have down there with multiple churches in the area. So it's it's uh, it is it's like complex, but it's simple. You know, if, if everybody just does their part, like, it, it makes sense. Hey, we go out, we evangelize the lost, we get people to believe in Jesus, but we need you to shepherd these people because that's what, we're not here to do this for ourselves. We're here to help you, right? Part of our first priority, our first goal. So, wanted to share that. Evangelize the lost. This is one of the four priorities and goals of Operation STL, and it should be uh, an everyday uh, priority for, for all of us, but not all of us are gifted to do that. We all have different gifts, and I'm not trying to say 
But everyone should be sharing the gospel as much as you possibly can. 